So here's the deal. It looks like your girl Jasmine Blue Washington with her fine ass is taking the social media to air out her baby daddy, Kirk Frost, and that goddamn Adam's apple. Now this is a shame. Y'all know how much I love my pretty girls, and I don't like my pretty girls to be getting ugly out here now. It's pretty damn hard for a woman as fine as Jasmine Blue Washington to get ugly because she is a supermodel. But she definitely went to social media and showed that she does have a dark side. If she don't shit it on Kirk Frost. Now, I blame the Adam's apple, but she's blaming Kirk. Here's what she said. Liar, liar, pants on fire. Shall I start posting texts? Contemplating emoji. Now, she's making reference to whatever was said on the Love and Hip Hop Atlanta Season 6 reunion show. It says, okay, so hit me tomorrow before work, Kirk. Okay, I got you. Now, here's what she had to say. Only posting this because this man has continued to drag my name through the mud and lie about everything. He's gone too far with the lies and defamation. So I will go uh, just as far with the truth if I'm a scammer. So are you at Frost117. Uh, for you slow pokes, my son was born in 2016. So yes, the messages are from then and before. Fast forward. Okay, so I'm slow as shit as we all know so I'm just gonna say gray text and green text because I don't know who's who because I'm dumb as fuck so gray gray text back in July 22nd of 2016 said what you doing I can come up if you're free green said I'm not home right now gray responded you stay gone did they fix the car green said they called me 30 minutes ago saying it's ready I'm gonna pick it up tomorrow because they close at 7 so Gray Tech said, okay, cool, what you doing? Green said, I'm out with friends, what you doing? Gray said, in the house, working on some bookings, trying to make a couple of bucks. Green said, no Gucci concert, Gucci mine. Gray said, so when am I going to see you? Green said, I just had to restart my phone again. So I didn't get the text you sent before that, but I'll let you know when I'm home because we need to talk. Nothing to get overly concerned about. Gray said, okay, well, I will be waiting on you. Do you have any idea around what time? Green said tomorrow will probably be better because it'll be too late. Rather, it'll be late. So Gray said a bunch of crying and sad face emojis bawling. I'm sad now. Wah. Okay, so I'm like a nervous wreck right now. So can you at least take like five minutes out and call me right quick? That sounds like a five minute fap. But anyways, uh, Green, Green said... I can't really have this combo the way I want to right now. But if you want, we could text. Why are you nervous? To which Gray responded, I feel like you've moved on or maybe you are back with your ex. So Gray also said, I feel like I've lost you, but you're probably saying I never had you. <clears throat> I don't know. You give off a really weird vibe of not caring. I would stop anything I was doing to make sure you was okay. Or if you felt like how I felt, I will stop and make sure you okay. But I guess when the shoe is on the other foot, it doesn't matter. Green responded, I think that it is time I moved on. And it's no better time than now. It's unrealistic to think this could ever work. You're married. I guess this is Jasmine saying it. Okay. You're married. And I want to be married one day too. Jasmine holler at me. Anyways, I just don't see the point. And us pretending to be something we could never actually be. It's not fair to me. Even that response is unrealistic because there's times where I can't even contact you when I've needed you because your phone has to be off at certain times around certain people. Is she talking about Rashida? Anyways, he responded, okay, so honestly, are you back with your ex? Very, very interesting. Very, very telling. She cut out something. Anything to do with anything I've said. Okay, yes, yeah, she cut out what she said before. Okay, mm-hmm. But anyways, Kurt goes on to say, <laughs> my feelings are really, really hurt. I personally feel like that's women for you cutting out the good part, cutting out the uh, the part that makes them look crazy. See how women are? Even pretty heifers like Jasmine Blue Washington are on that heifer-itis. My feelings are really, really hurt. I personally feel like we could go very far in a relationship. I think one of the most important things is getting to know each other first. If you can deal with me, and if I can deal with you being able to be friends, care for one another, care for one another, love one another, no commas, the grammar's atrocious, must say grammar is your mother's mother, what the fuck? 
with me and if I can deal with you being able to be friends, care for one another, love one another. I feel like that's a growing process and didn't feel like it was a big rush to get there. For the record, do I love you? Yes, I do. Why and how I fell in love with you? I don't even know. Honestly, she got that snapper. She got that amazing penis fly trap that can devour a man with one bite. One nibble will swallow a niggle. I'm trying to tell you. Anyways, I think about this all the time. Yeah, I really, really like you. I really love you. And I don't know how to tell you that because it kind of felt like you don't care about me. And the cold shoulder thing kind of hurts pretty bad. First of all, she looks like fucking... Carrie Hilson. I mean, how could you not love her? Oh my God. Anyways, I guess she sent him a picture of the baby and she said, uh, did I get the pics? You? He said, yes, he's super handsome. Uh, uh, five hearts and eyes emoji. Fucking adulterer. I blame the Adam's apple. She said, laughing out loud. He said, Northside Hospital, right? She said, yeah. Young Jeezy voice. So July 26th of 2016 at 9.57 p.m. He, he let now this is all allegedly Kirk. He said, did the pain slow down some? And did he eat? She said, yeah and yeah. She said, yeah. Like Usher and Ludacris. So anyways, this is allegedly a conversation between Kirk and Jasmine. I think it's fake. Personally, I think she, now she had him marked down on the phone as just the letter K. I think it said K K A A, but she deleted the AA for Kirk's Adam's apple. I blame that goddamn tumor in his neck. I think it's that damn lump in his throat that's cheating on Rashida and going around impregnating bitches with that apple juice, that apple cider, and that apple sauce. That motherfucker looks crazy. His goddamn neck looked like he swallowed a cherry and it just stopped. It did not make it to the stomach. I'm eating cherries that I record this year and you cherries are good as a motherfucker. Anyway. Let me know what y'all think about this shit, bro. I just feel bad for Rashida. If all this shit is for real, it's like, this can't be life. Rashida's too damn good to be getting cheated on by any fucking body. If I were Rashida, there'll be no pussy in the world I'd be thinking about other than hers. I'm sorry, y'all. When she wasn't around and we couldn't get down, shit, I'll just pull up a nice little picture of her and pull out the lotion. I don't understand how any man could cheat on his wife, period, but Rashida... She just fucking perfect. I don't get it. Oh, this is the way she looks. She's just cool as hell. She's like a really nice lady. I don't understand. I think about it could hurt such a wonderful lady like her. I don't know. Just my opinion. What do I know? Just an asshole with a microphone. Since so Jasmine Blue Washington wants to get married, them DMs are about to be slid up in tonight. I'm about to spit this crazy blogger game, all this ism at that ass, because I've been reading Tariq and She's books. And I have the Mac within now. About to do it the elite way. And wish me luck when it comes to that booty. I'm going to find a shit. He might have said she's not. I said, hey, God damn, these cherries are good as shit. I can't stop eating them. Motherfucker. Do anybody hate on me either? You wish you had these cherries, bitches. Anyways, your titties look like cherries. Fuck y'all. Y'all think it's a real conversation or what? Let me know what y'all think about it all below. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 on Google Plus, Meat Magazine blog and Instagram. And I sound like the Micro Machine Man right now. Oh, you fucking 80s and 90s babies and shit. Be sure to subscribe to the Meat Magazine YouTube channels. Visit meatmagazine.blogspot.com for more. Follow me on Twitter at Meat Magazine, Meat Magazine 7 on Google Plus. Meat Magazine blog and Instagram. Hit the notification button. It's right next to the subscribe button. It looks like a bell. Once you click that button, you'll be sent a notice to be notified when new videos get posted. Real conversation or fake conversation. Let me know in the comments. Oh, you want some of these cherries or what, bitches? These motherfuckers are good. I bet Jasmine tastes better than these cherries, though. I'm sorry. <laughs> she fine as shit.